Alright. Welcome to part 21 of Let's Play Let's the Old Republic. And that is apparently a window. I, I saw that towards the end of the last part and I was just Don't you believe a word of what Circa said in there? There is always a peaceful solution to conflict. They're just lazy. Circa Myers have been attacked by sand people, so the company Circa Corporation wants them to kill them. Sand people are animals that watch them and they're intelligent. There must be a way to peacefully stop the attacks. I know it. No, we'll try it, of course. You can't even leave the city without certain approval. I want the sand people dead. To some people, it must have seemed like an invasion. There were no negotiations with territory. I think the killing has been justified, but as a conservative invasionist, I'm hoping someone at least tries to talk this out. We can just speak to them, but they don't talk. At least not in any language an average translator understood. There's even a Jedi here a few years ago that couldn't seem to get through to them. I think that ended in blood too. Uh, pretty rare. For sure, I've heard something about an unusual droid in the shop here on Tatooine. So I heard Yukalaka say it could speak a sound of people dialect. Kuya <laughs> So it's circa, you say, then they just start shooting people. The fighting won't stop until they're all dead. Or until the Zerka leaves. But it's as likely as the other with the way things are going. So yeah, you can... You actually can peacefully resolve things with the uh, with the sand people, although um, I believe it is easier just to kill them all. The peaceful solution, I believe, is quite difficult. Biggest desert rain skull plant I've seen in the season. Imagine as I get more trophies, I can sell them there. I never talked to the uh, the merchant in here either.
Yeah, we don't have any. We don't really have any cash here. Greetings again from the. Yes, we're still waiting for you to return with the Sand People Chieftain's Gaffy Stick. I'll reward you well when you do. We don't have any new information on the subject, and I would remind you that you did agree to do. Fair. I guess that's all the bounties. Down here are some Jawas. Ooh, they do translate. I saw a crate dragon once. Well, not up close. Yeah, so I can go register for. Oh, Dark Jedi. Lord Malak was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Taris alive. He has promised a great reward to whoever destroys you. Of, uh... Oh yeah, we got stuff. Hang on, I'm having trouble with control. Double bladed saber with the yellow crystal. We have a dark Jedi Knight robe. Your wish? What? That is so weird. What can I do? What is it? Hmm? I guess the saber colors change. be of assistance to you, Padawan. What is it you would like to speak to me about? Are you doing all right? I, I, I thank you for your concern, but I am still a bit shaken. I have been thinking about myself, about Kotra, and about my fall to the dark side. I keep thinking that it was my anger that drove me that far, that nearly damned me. Inside myself now, and I can still see it. I still feel it. Hmm. 
More time would do me good. Time to distance myself from that anger. I think that is why the Council agreed to send me with you. They think, perhaps, that in your company, I will be able to free myself from it. I thank you for your concern and your acceptance. I will strive to prove that I am worthy of your company and trust. Poison immunity is pretty good. All the things we can engineer. Yes, your wish. Cantina. I'm here. Lots of lots of stuff between here and the outside. Droid shop. So yeah, we've just got to work our way through the city. So we can swoop. <laughs> Been a hot one, I owe. As soon as the circle is back on its feet. I need to pay out. It's obvious my old laws have caught up to me. I knew what would happen. The Force should not be used for profit and personal gain. As Jedi, we should be above such things. It's everything I have. Now just leave me to figure out how I'm going to pay for track time. For fifty credits. <laughs> I guess that, uh, it's not that I'm unhappy with the dark side, I'm just curious what else he has to say. <laughs> Oh, 
Too many years I raced out of West Irish track and all I got to show for is managing bikes. No good memories? That seems a waste. Should have quit after the Coruscant Classic. <laughs> I better hope so, it's the last stop for me. If I can't get some decent times going, I may as well not leave. Your second is a structure of terrorists as an excuse, but I doubt I would have never made it back there. Babies, except for Zorus. Nico's kid has a future. He has a fear of the track. You get old, you start to worry about failing. He just lets it all come to him. The force should not. I'll take his 50 credits. Need to get him to stop racing, really. For a slot on the track? Me too. There's lots of racers coming through here now. We have a bunch of soup racers. Got no clue about anything but the track. <laughs> Nothing we can do. Alright, he doesn't really... Go on, leave me alone. I've got stuff to worry Ooh, about. Ooh, he speaks English. Racer stuff. Nothing you'd understand. Don't mean to be rude, but it's kind of secret. Ha, sure. Race your bike out of that explosion. Everyone knows that the whole planet is gone. Nobody got out. I'm not in the mood for jokes, thanks. I've got things to think about. You wouldn't know anything about it. Deal with that hut Mata and you will understand. Until then, I just don't want to talk about it. Track coordinator, soup groupie. I was due to race on Terrace, but I blew a qualifying race. Guess I'm lucky, huh? Tangabun Shan Om Nang, Wanga Kun Beast Kim Va Mula Ra, Choni Yun Tun Gigi Ida Duana, Kava Vulpa Muji Gumana, China Pala Mula, Tong Ki Ba. Mucha Shakapaka, Yi Ki Kun Noba. 
Kakin Cha na Quat na Bon Con, Wana Kumbes. Pack of Terrace has seemed more important. Some of the hunters in Father's Lodge seem like they would know more than I would, but I wouldn't take much. Kakin Cha na Quat na Bon Con, Wana Professional racers like myself travel around the purses of hearts. She's the um, old guy from the ballerina, basically, the nice experience. One of the most popular tracks was lost in terrorists. You lose the skills if you don't use them. I can race on any open road, but competition gives the push to get better. Besides, if my presence was a little prestigious track, we will get some new racers out of it. Maybe they jump from one leg to another and wanted to shed some baggage. Don't waste much thought on it. was really a personal matter that has no bearing today. Garam tries hard and I wish him well, but Nico is the one to watch. Kakin cha na kwat na bon con, wana kumbes chi pala mulek tonki pa na nonek tu nik ton chu 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 Necessary side of the sport, we must make someone money or there will be no circuit. That's basically. Okay. Uh, nobody. What do you want, huh? Hand out? Go dig a mine, fool. Not interested in helping, only interested in racing. Get enough beggars through here looking for money. You race, maybe on a swoop. Uh, you and twelve other liars, plan it blows up. Race records are lost, and now everyone is a champion. My friend tells the truth. I am a Jedi. You're going to imply that I am lying as well. Now you are a champion and travel with Jedi. Does the story get bigger with every telling? Enough of the funny stuff. You think you're a racer, you'll be one. Do you have your own bike? Get a bike, then you can race. I don't care about experience. As long as you can get out on the track. Oh, 
You crash and burn, that's your problem. I just need warm bodies to pad the roster between the pros. Small track maintenance fee. You don't need to pay the fee, it's just a formality. I'll let you use the track for practice and set up your first official race right away. So ask me when you want to start and there's some business I need help with. If you're serious about promoting racing. I make money off of signing good racers. Good ones, not great ones. I want them young and stupid. I've got one, Miko Senvi. Great potential. Well, I started racing a year ago and he loves it. He lives it for it now. And? Sounds like you have something special. What do you want help with? I want a simple. I want Nico to sign a contract with you. I want you to convince him. I'll pay well. Why won't he say? The deal basically says that I fund his bike and repairs. In return, I take a hefty cut out of his winnings. He knows it's harsh, but he can't afford to go pro on his own and doesn't want to give up racing. <laughs> give a little push in the right direction or a big shove. I know what's best. Trust me, actually, none of them do. I'm the promoter. I do it for money. They all just want the glory. You win enough, he'll respect you. Even if he doesn't, make him choose correctly. Twenty racing bars. Racing bars are monetary notes. I issue so local vendors know who my friends are. There were ten times their number in credits and sometimes more. Depends on how much of a friend you are. Racing 
And for the first time, to reach each tier, does each tier pay? To pay each level only once. Now here to support you, I only pay to encourage constant improvement. Alright. Oh, hi. You another racer then? I heard someone new was talking to Mata. Always room for more, I guess. Don't know how much longer I'll be around here. But maybe we'll have time for a few races. Did you? I'm not sure that's any of your business. Top racers keep to their own. I don't know you. Maybe if you were better on the track, I might feel like talking about it. Someone who can turn out the fast times might understand. If there's anything around, it'll be at the Zerka store in their office in the center of town. Stock is scarce on this rock. Hurry up. All right. Uh, that's interesting. See if they actually do sell these upgrades. Was that just a thing they were saying? Anyway. I suppose we'll do some races and then we'll work to the uh, cantina later. Recreational race. Please do before each race. How else am I supposed to sponsor prize money at the level I do? I need to see some returns. They're investing in my writers, but I also need to see profit, though. No. They're great by logic. If you don't, you don't race. The price is reasonable. <laughs> I warn you, I have people who make sure I don't give too many favors. You won't get this discount again. <laughs>
So we got bracing bonds. I guess it's his time I did first. I believe this is doable, it's just going to be tricky. Just about. That wasn't fast enough? That was a 20, or was that a 23.5? Oh, I missed it by 200 for a second.
Well, so much for that. I'll be back later in the past. Kind of takes a perfect run. You shattered my track record and took tier 3. Any racing bonds was the deal. That's the last I'll be giving you, I hope. You're too fast for most of my racers. Yum 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 yum. You again? I don't really feel like talking right now. I suppose you've got a right to no track business, but with the times you've been posting. Don't you want to deal with it's more that I'm not grateful? I mean, it would get me into the pros. I don't have the credits to get in on my own. Not that I care about credits. I just want to race. But the deal with Mata is pretty bad. He'll get most of what I win. You know, you might know a good deal, I guess. You sure know your way around the track. Forcing the boy to sign his life away, is that really necessary? I... I'll sign the contract. Yeah, I guess that's best. Uh, I mean, the deal can't be all bad, right? I mean, you'd know, right? And all I want is to race. Who cares about the credits? Who cares? Thanks for making things clear. If you don't mind, I think we're done. Goodbye. Leave me alone, will ya? Yep, that nudges us a little closer to neutral. <laughs> Very good. I'll have him training up his parent rock as soon as possible. He'll make me rich. I'm happy to pay it. I think I should ask for more. <laughs> you take a lot of money from me already. Winning each tier like you have, this is it. There's no more. I'd really like to pay you more. I think I can manage something. I don't know why I was arguing. 
I'll pay you half again what I said, and that's all. Now I have to plan for Nico's training. Is there anything else? Alright. No dark side points for bilking money out of him. Alright, um... You, you're the one. You beat Zoros Bafka's ti time? I have to get your auto print. Sure I am. You are a fast for human, and once the races are running regular again, you'll be famous. Well, maybe you will. If you start winning on the real tour, I want to be able to say I saw you when you were just starting out. How about it? Sure, why not? Really, that is great of you. You will be a fan favorite. Some of the race are solid friends, but that is just rude. Here, just put your head on this path. Thanks again. I know I'll be seeing more of you, human. I th think Circa pays for... How may I be of assistance to you, Padawan? What is it you would like to speak to me about? Would you come to be a Jedi? To be a Jedi? I am sure you would not find it very interesting. Are you sure you would like to hear? Yes, please continue. Well, it goes back a number of years. Back on my home world, we did not see Jedi very often, especially where I lived. Where did you live? The hind end of space. A pit of a world, to be sure, where Jedi rarely tread. But we had heard of them. Well, everyone had, so that is not to be unexpected. Champions of truth, defenders of justice, heroes of the Republic. It was very easy for a child to be enthralled by their image, their mystique. Maybe I was one of those children. Did you meet a Jedi? Yes. Yes, I did. When I saw a Jedi for the first time, they lived up to everything my imagination had created them to be. I was old, and maybe a little enamored. They were quite striking, especially the tales of their leader. From that moment on, I knew that I would have to try to become a Jedi. To lift myself out of the rut I had been living in for years, and to make a real difference as the Jedi War. <laughs> the foolish delusions of a child, but this child made it happen. As soon as I was able, I left my world and went in search of them. I found them and was accepted. I had been living my dream on Dantooine for several years before you came, although perhaps I was not entirely ready for it. Or not completely suited to the task. Otherwise, I would not have fallen. But thanks to you, I have been redeemed. Perhaps I may yet live to see that dream of mine come true. Come, there is much we should do. Let us not waste time talking. Action is what is needed. I think we can go sell our bonds up here.
for around 60 credits. Means we have about 6,000. More than that, maybe? Jeez. Anyway. We will leave it at Swoop Racing. And that will end the uh, part and recording session for the day. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you have and haven't already done so, feel free to follow button one time or sub, like, and share if you're on YouTube. Till next time, have a great one. Till then, later on, to be continued.